Thank you, Madam President. I too rise in support of the legislation and wanted to thank the good chair Moore for her hard work on this important bill. I have a mobile home in, in my district whose residence I met with and was bought by an outside company. And I'll never forget the day I met with them in a community center. Uh, most of them elderly, uh, most of them on Social Security, a few gentlemen with Vietnam hats and World War II hats. These are uh, men and women on fixed incomes, often uh, some who served our country, who were suddenly faced with rapid increases in their monthly mobile home rent and could not sustain it and were afraid. Were afraid because they did not, they had been living in this mobile home park some upwards of 30 years, didn't know what they were going to do and had to make difficult choices. Uh, you know, having a home and a, a safe place you can create memories is important. Uh, many of the folks I met with, their grandchildren for decades have come to visit them and spend time with them. These are not oftentimes, uh, we have I think a, a picture in our head about what it is, but for many folks, it's their, their home. It's where they had a birthday party. It's where they celebrated anniversaries. It's where they spent time with their grandchildren. It's where they have deep relationships and trust with their neighbors. And what we're seeing across the country, unfortunately, is large companies scooping up a lot of these mobile home parks uh, with little to no notification to the renter, the mobile home owners, and literally overnight um, having to scramble. And in some cases, perhaps in some quarters, you know, an extra 50, 100, 150, $200 a month may not seem like a lot. But for many of these folks, it is. Uh, as I mentioned, they're on fixed incomes, and uh, many of them serve their country. So I'm going to be proud of Castle Yesville today, and I want to thank the good chair for our hard work on this. Uh, this is important work, and these are important people who deserve our support, and I'm really going to be proud of Castle Yesville, and I encourage my colleagues to also do the same today. Thank you, Madam President.